Well-rested group of Peterborough Peets took it to the Bulls in their fourth game in five nights on New Year's Day, going three for four on the power play en route to a five to one win. Andrew D'Agostini held off the Belleville offense early in goal for Peterborough before Brandon Devlin scored once and added two assists, while Stephen Varga scored his first OHL goal in 139 games. The Bulls had a third period marker from Scott Simmons on a give and go with line mate Jake Marchment but we're outdone to kick off 2014. Here's Wednesday's recap. A missed assignment there. Poppy play there as Nosad intercepts and now it's fired up. A break for Jake Bricknell. He's in all alone. Bricknell, the move, and a stop. Rebound, the puck is there. Bean tries to fire, he can't get up. Brody Morris's foot and will go back to the point. Purnell gets it again. There's a nice pass down low, a shot, they score! What a shot, Seymour I believe was Hatcher, 6'2", 200, and he's putting some good punches in on Heffernan, 6'2", 188, and he takes him down. Ewell to Subban. Now a nice pass to Scott Simmons, good vision on that pass as Simmons gains the line. It's Marchman into Simmons. What a move, he scores! 24 seconds into the period, Scott Simmons gets the ball. Got the spark, that momentum that they needed. We'll see how Peterborough responds. We'll see how Belleville responds. Alex Ewell gets caught by Devlin. And now the puck is breaking out as it's two on one. McDonald, Richie with the puck. Richie, saucer to McDonald, they score! They regain the four goal lead, Peterborough. As he misses the net on that one behind the net, McGuire. 19 year old blue liner Adam Bignall has been a fixture on the Belleville penalty kill for a few years now. He says improving their performance a man down is a top priority moving forward. He also doesn't make any excuses despite a busy schedule since returning from the Christmas break. Uh, you know, s some personnel change from last year, but I mean, again, it, there, there's no excuse for us, you know, with the, with the penalty kill. It's, it's something that, uh, you know, you, you got to take pride in and, and you look at any, any championship team, you know, they always have, you know, good, good penalty kills. So, you know, it's something that we, we work on every day in practice and we're going to continue to work on it and try to get better. I mean, for us, you know, we don't want to use that as an excuse. I mean, uh, you know, these were, were some, some big games, and, uh, you know, we're disappointed that, uh, you know, we let some, uh, some key games on home ice go. But, uh, you know, looking forward, we got a lot of hockey left, and, you know, we can't dwell on this. You know, we got to get ready for, uh, for Saturday. The Windsor Spitfires come to town on Saturday night as the Bulls try their hand at a Western Conference opponent. For Bulls TV, I'm Josh Sweetland.